Hey, finally, in this video, we're going to talk about what is Tor Browser, what is Dark Web, and how to access Dark Web through Tor Browser, and how you can get Tor Browser in an easy and sufficient manner, which is a really secretive manner that nobody teaches on YouTube. It's just they tell you on superficially. But today, we're going to talk about in this detail. And this video may be taken down, but before it's taken down, make sure to subscribe to this channel comment on this video and let's get to it so first of all what you have to do is make sure download the dark uh, the tar browser for that you can use any browser either chrome or safari because we cannot use the normal browsers to you know access dark web we only need tar browser so tar browser is something which the most hacker or most you know ethical hackers use to you know work on their projects or you know uh, open sites which cannot be easily open so this is what you actually need so we are here what you have to do is search for tar browser on google and go and download the tar project from tarproject.org just go inside it actually tar browser is actually an onion oriented website which means nobody can trace your location so it's every layer of onion is kind of hiding your location so tar browser has you know surfaces uh, you know the browser on, on either on android your linux mac os and windows so i usually avoid download on android and uh, windows because uh, they are not that much safe comparatively android is not that much safe but you can use uh, you know uh, windows and linux is really good and mac os is always always this has been good so when you're using when you're downloading the tar browser make sure that there are a few settings you have to keep in mind before you know accessing dark web I'll tell you in these steps the so first thing what you have to do is download for any you know the device you're using I'm currently using a Mac OS so what I have to do is download this uh, you know tar browser on Mac OS I already downloaded it because I always use it on my you know whenever I'm searching for something that I don't want anybody to know so that's why I always use so when you are done downloading this is how it will appear on your you know uh, what you call on your surface so this is an onion layer written tar browser it's appeared on my you know it's already downloaded and established what I have to do is just open it when you just open it it will take two few times because tar browser usually takes a lot of time because it is trying to protect your identity so first of all what you have to do when you are on tar browser you don't have to full screen don't don't make it full screen because full screen has cache and cache actually traces your location so never do full screen on tar browser so first you have to keep in that, that in mind the second thing is make sure open click on this security level so I already pushed it onto safer level that's what you have to do to do that you might see something else in here so for to do to do this what you have to do is go into advanced security settings when you are in advanced security settings normally it's on standard but you have to move it to safer level because safer level is that you will see something that you know easily available you, you can see pictures and all that but when you are on safest you cannot see the images or media scripts you know it affects a lot of them so this is how you can do and if you want to block the dangerous and deceptive content you can also do that in case if you want so this is these are the options you have to consider before uh, you know browsing for uh, further but this is the main option you must consider when you're done doing to the safest make sure close the full tab again close all tabs and again close it from here quiet it quit it and reopen it again tar browser when you reopen it make sure it is again on the safer level so if it's on safer level make sure go and delete the go and clear the you know whole history of this so to the browser will close all windows and tabs all website sessions will be lost so we have to clear all that and click on yes everything is gone now we are refreshed so when you're on the website on the tar browser what you have to do is search for a directory most of the guys what they do is just go on dark web and search directly for things remember things won't appear directly because you are using some of the very very layered uh, you know uh, browser in this world is this very secretive so you must be very creative when you're searching for something uh, especially on the tar browser because you get a lot of fake links you can lose your money 
when you're using this you know it's it's very much complicated there's no tracing involved no email is involved no login credentials are involved so you are in the market and it's very easy to get deceptive the first of all what you have to do is click on just search for dark web directories and search it on tar browser and connect it it will take a few seconds okay, I told you already it will take a few times because this thing takes a lot of time because this is the really slow thing on uh, compared to all browsers more of the tower browser make sure it's always half screen and do not access anything that is you know we cannot show you anything else or illegal because last time a video was taken down on YouTube uh, because of this so I, we have to really respect that dark web directories we all have to search it again because we have to respect the community on YouTube that's already looking for content so we have already directories this is 2021 directory what you have to do is open up multiple directories so we'll find one that is better better than other and do not open it in another web because it's also again against the security level so keep it up here we'll see again these are the directories so this is something I would consider this is a good directory because on this you can see even the websites that are really reputed are available on dark web on the hidden to our browser so the hidden wiki is also available like there are contents that are not usually available on all Wikipedia so you have to they are available on hidden wiki on wiki uh, that is on a dark web you have dark web Facebook version you have a lot of mail to tar like there are a lot of uh, already I made a video on that how you can send a message without anybody knowing or tracing your location so this is what you are going to use there are many of them secure on the other hand if you went if you went these are the other websites you might you know consider going again there are other links that I won't recommend you should go on because there are a lot of markets available in here these markets have been taken down time by time because a lot of markets also have been taken down um, like the Emperor market it was taken down a lot of time ago and people reached out to me like asking why this market is has been taken down I have nothing to do with the market uh, it's just the the Fed well, you know found something illegal and they have taken down definitely there was something illegal in it so this is sci hub you can find all, all the articles that are you know secretive or paid for these are for free so there are a lot of content in here uh, any content you're looking for that is available on dark web I'm not exactly opening up the links because I have to respect the community but as far as dark web is concerned you have to follow these protocols and if you follow these protocols you will never get in trouble I assure you that and before ending this video make sure you comment on this video like this video subscribe to this channel because that will be really supportive because these videos don't get that much monetized so we have to make money out of you uh, if you could donate to us our channel that would be really great thank you so much thank you for watching see you in the video keep visiting Tig's schooling